everybody so this is a response to my previous video which i made uh, available and there was some uh, response uh, from feedback from students that uh, they couldn't uh, do the that code so one thing is that uh, because you are working on python so python is an interpreted uh, language not a compiled language so you are working on interpreter and uh, you should have known this by now by reading the book the book Thing going on now. I'm sitting on outside okay so this the book uh, is interactive mode uh, has has a script mode and interactive mode so in, in a interactive mode you you get this prompt over here and uh, this is called the chevron the Python chevron this is the uh, prompt and if you want to make a file that's called the script mode so you should know this so let's start the idle and I will give you some also some example if I if I have this idle this is my idle so this is an interpreter so I'm right on interactive mode so if I just say H it's not giving me anything because H is not defined so it gets immediately response uh, gives a response to me that H is not defined if I say H is equal to 10 so I have a value H and it doesn't give me output but if I say H now it gives me output immediately so this is an interactive mode you have this thing so same as like if I say odd odd of H so this H is now a string not not this H so if I do this it gives me one one of four immediately gives me the output of it but if I have this uh, same file as a script now so I will create a new file I now I have the script node. If I say or eight now, I need another uh, code set. So this now, even if I save it, like if I just say I'm saving it as, oh, I need to save it somewhere. I will save it to by this. I save it to as test. And now I have a script which is called tests py. So it's my script file. This is not my. But if I even if I like control s, I have saved it. Run f5 to run it. I don't get anything because this is not interactive mode. Here, if I need to print uh, this thing, I what I need to do is that I have to print this. F control S and F5. Now it prints F104. So see this difference between the last time when I was doing it, I was doing it all on interactive mode. So interactive mode is very helpful when you are learning something. You can work on interactive mode and then you can uh, do this uh, on your script mode. So let's say like if I have now I have text as hello I go for for I in text get print so I have to say print here print odd value of I and end it with If I say control S, save and F5, now I get all the values. I can even now I can what I can even do is that instead of printing it, I define another text here which is equal to print not text text two is equal to empty string. I Instead of here, what I can do is that text two is equal to the chr value of my odd plus ninety nine. 
this so my text has something now I can do this and now I at the end I hope this will work friend text to so control s fine I'm getting something or oh, only I'm most probably the other characters are not getting printed I can it just say okay so, so what I need is that I need oh yeah sorry so what I need is text equal this text to plus so each time I am adding the that value to text one character I'm adding one character each time and then after the for loop I have all the whole string converted into this encrypted into this and then I have this print this value control s5 so I have these. Well, previously it was only printing the last character because I was not doing the text equal text plus. So this way I can uh, convert. So now I have the text two as my encrypted. If somebody wants me to uh, decrypt it, I have to run a for loop, and I don't know this is my. So instead of this 99, I can also do this. Is that this is my key? Key is 99. And here, what I will do is set key. So I have now I'm using a variable control s. So you see, uh, I'm getting the same. Hopefully, you can see this. So yeah, I'm getting the same result over here. Even my key is now different. So if I uh, even if I need to change the key, I can what I can one one one. So control S F five. My code is totally different because my key was different. If I see my key is only nine only with small key, I totally get something else. So. Hopefully this this help and uh, do remember the difference between Chevron and uh, the script mode. So when you are working on interactive mode, you are over here. You don't need to print; it prints automatically. But here you need to print, and it's a script mode. So hopefully this help. Let me know if you still have any problem. Thanks.